Our opening face-off brought to you by Irvine Auto Center, and we're underway, and glad to have you along with us. Blues into the Anaheim zone. Here's Bold Duke. The rookie scores! Just 11 seconds in. Snaps it by glove side, and St. Louis has a wonderful start. Well, that did not take long. A Bold Duke kind of caught Lucas Stolstal. An immediate breakdown in the neutral zone by the Ducks, and you can see, watch the defenseman. You can see Radko Gudis there. Got caught cheating a little bit to the inside. The wing was open. There was no support there. Tucker retreats at center, and the rookie defenseman wires it right back in for St. Louis. Hayes off the boards, gets it on net. Nice save on the rebound on Torochenko. Torochenko oh, oh. pinned to the boards by Nesterenko, and the puck pops free. Nesterenko gets it back from Silverberg, makes a pass to Lindstrom, and that was blocked by Perunovic, who lost his stick in the process. And Nikita Nesterenko is going to get to the rebound and score. I was about to say, Hazy, I think he might want to shoot that puck next time he gets in the middle of the ice. He did so there. This is just a perfect example of that. Looking for Lindstrom, you're right. He may want to shoot that puck, but, you know, the reaction afterwards is what's most important. He gets to the front of the net. Perico can't find that loose puck in front of Bennington. Goes off the toe of Bennington. It's a big, fat rebound. And a great moment for Nikita Nestorenko. I know he's been explicitly instructed to look away, <laughs> but that's kind of hard to do, I, isn't it? Yeah, I was told to turn away. Uh-oh. There's a turnover just inside the blue line. Shen had trouble getting into the neutral zone. Gains the zone. Thomas finds the trailer. Right down Main Street, and it's 2-1. Kessel, the defenseman, coming late, has his first National Hockey League goal. Well, Matthew Kessel, last game, and he just joins the play, and the Ducks are slow getting back to help out. So Owen Zellweger was caught on that play when the puck was mishandled entering the St. Louis zone. And whenever that happens and there's a turnover like that at the offensive blue line. Kalorn gives it to Zegers. Trevor into the St. Louis zone, caught by the back-checking Sammy Blay, who gave him a, excuse me, Bolduc gave him a little cross-check. It comes to Kalorn in front, and they score! He snuck it underneath Bennington, and Vetrano found it first. Through the crease area, he tries to just slip it five hole. It gets in behind Bennington. Vetrano just touches it, and Bennington reaching back for it. Look at the reaction of the goaltender. He inadvertently swats it into the back of the net, so a little help from the goaltender, Bennington. Blues 0 for 1 with the extra man as Krug drops it off for Jordan Kairu. Thomas transports into the zone. Kairu with it. Quickly to the point for Krug. Thomas curls off the wall. Scores! Robert Thomas. A three-point night. It's 3-1 St. Louis. That is a sneaky, fast release from Robert Thomas when he releases this puck. I mean, this is a perfect shot. You're going to see it about a foot and a half off of the ice, just over the pad, just inside the post. Look at that shot. I mean, that, that's a half inch over top of the pad of Lucas Dostal. Strom drops it off. Zegers back to Strom behind the net, and Pareko takes it away. Colton Pareko. Leads NHL defenseman in takeaways entering tonight, and that sets up Kairu Buchnevich with a gaping net. It's four to two. Anaheim picked up the third man into the zone, but nobody picks up the fourth man into the zone, and he is wide open for the one timer. This is a very patient play by the Blues. The Ducks are changing. So they kind of work it around. They get a a lot of space in front of Lucas Dostal. The Ducks a little bit guilty of looking at the puck and not being aware of the passing options available. Zellweger at the line. Fakes the one-timer, gives it to Terry. Little two-man game continues between them. Final seconds 
of the penalty to Tucker. Terry into the slot. Lundestrom right to the side of that. Second remaining in the penalty to Tyler Tucker past that puck. I think it kind of went off the heel of his stick. But Leo Carlson hanging around the front of the net. Yeah, he was trying to shoot that on that. It goes off the heel of his stick. Great to Leo Carlson and the quick hands of Leo Carlson. He knows he has to elevate it to get over the pad of Bennington. And the Ducks are right back in this game. Kairou, bottom of the left circle. Trying to find a passing lane. It comes right back to him. Thomas gives it up. Drifts into that bumper position. Great save with the right pad by Dostal. And then Kairou gets into the far post for a tap in. Braden Shen, it's 5-3. Well, the Blues were moving that puck down to the goal line. Finding the bumper position wide open. Thomas with that first bid puck comes across and Braden Shen strong on his stick Cam Fowler's trying to get back there can't prevent that pass from getting through to Shen and it's a now this is strong Little diagonally dumped to the left corner of Toronto on it first behind the net Zegers converged upon back to the Toronto loose side of the net Zegers scores that kept that puck alive behind the net. The goaltender, Bennington. There's Zegers keeping it alive. Oh, you're right. One-handed, Hazy. Great play by Zegers to get that puck. And credit Frank for Toronto. Didn't waste any time whatsoever. The backhanded shot, is, it's a tough shot for goaltenders to pick up the release, but... Carlson gives it right back, and Cam storms in. Drop pass to Kalorn. One more trailer. Carlson, he goes right back to the well again high blocker on Bennington and this time it's all about speed good entry from Fowler and then Kalorn finds Carlson real smart comes in late Gets into that soft area in the middle of the ice. He, he saw Alexandra fall. And that was the cue for Leo Carlson to slide into the middle of the ice. Kalorn put it right on the tape and a beautiful finish. 15 seconds left in overtime. The Blues possess. Through the middle, Pareko, and it's just out of his reach. Dostal will sweep it away. Two on one of the Ducks. Six seconds left. Terry shoots off of Bennington behind the net and comes back to him and he covers up. Will be the first Blues shooter. One of three on the year. He speeds in off right wing. Now slows down. And scores on the backhand. Trying to get the goaltender to retreat. To mistime his retreat. Either be too aggressive or too deep. If not, the Blues get the extra point. Terry swings in off the left side. Bennington, very aggressive. And he makes the save. The Blues get the extra point in the shootout. St. Louis wins it 6-5. Well, that's superb goaltending in the shootout from Jordan Bennington. He, he made three. He made two outstanding stops.